What up, everybody? It's been a while since I uploaded an actual, like, autograph-related video. Uh, but I want to get one up. I will never stop making YouTube videos unless YouTube goes away, which I don't see happening. Um, so I wanted to uh, upload the video. Hope everybody's good out there. I, uh, I'm going through a lot of different life things at the moment. Um, that's why I haven't uploaded. I haven't really purchased much. I have gotten a few TTMs back, but I haven't felt like uploading a video. But uh, it's felt like I want to get back in the groove again and start uploading videos and and uh, that's that. So my apologies and my apologies if I have not watched your video videos. Um, YouTube has decided to uh, I don't know something's messed up with the subscription feed that. It used to be when you would upload a video that the person that uploaded latest is who you would see on your subscription feed. But now it decides that it's going to put videos that you watch the most, which I'm, I watch car videos the most. There's not a ton of uh, card videos, you know, people that post card content anymore. So I watch a lot of car videos too since my, that's my other hobby. So, um, yeah. So, I don't know, YouTube's just weird with shit they've been changing, and, but, uh, yeah, man, I got some things in, I'll show, uh, I'm gonna talk a little bit about my life, because that's what I do some t from time to time, there's some things going on that, uh, I'll address, and that's that, so, um, most of you probably won't give two shits about these, uh, things, but I figured I'll show them anyway. Uh, TTMs, I don't even remember what I showed anymore. I got uh, Austin Hoover back a while back. And he sent a, or signed my 8x10. And told me that uh, he was wearing my Zebra Strong wristband. Um, so, who Austin Hooper signed photo. Uh, Austin Dillon signed promo. Or, uh, what do they call these? Something cards. I forget what they're called. But, uh, I was following him at the beginning of the year. First couple of races. And the guy's kind of a prick. So, I, uh, I started off the year liking uh, Austin Dillon and Bubba Wallace. And as you can see, the shirt that I'm wearing right now, which is the United States Air Force shirt that I got in recently um i decided to just start following bubba wallace and get rid of fucking austin dillon i still like austin dillon but he's kind of a prick so there's that and speaking of bubba wallace uh there was a guy that had two a bunch of photos listed um and i just bought them i got them really cheap here's this one signed in silver Bubba's real name is Daryl, Daryl Wallace Jr., so, but, uh, there's that, and this one I'm gonna send to Richard Petty, that's why I bid on it, I love the STP car, so I had to pick that up, and hopefully, uh, Petty will send it over here, I'm gonna get that out of ASAP, because, you never know, Petty's old, and you don't know how long a person has to live, so, um, yeah, that and then uh the biggest one that i got in this is my favorite driver when i was a kid um and he was uh taken too soon um but i was devastated as a kid man i think i was eight years old when he passed killed in a helicopter accident crash and uh the guy had all the all the talent in the world man and I used to have all those little die cast cars. I think I had like, I had every time they release a die cast car from out, I'd I'd, uh, I'd buy it because um, I would get like a couple dollars a week for allowance. But uh, none other none other than Davy Allison. So 
Are these called hero cards? I think, yeah, hero cards. There's the autograph there. It looks really good. It doesn't look that good in the video, but actually it looks really good in person. So It's not in great shape. See there, it's got a little bit of... And there's a little, like right there, you can see a little crease. Not crease, but um, just from being old. I'm going to frame that up. Hang it up on the wall. And uh, and then uh, after he died, I started following Ernie Irvin, which wasn't the same. You know, Ernie Irvin was not nearly as good as Davey Allison. And uh, Dale Earnhardt, and then Dale Earnhardt was killed. And obviously I followed Junior. Um, junior. Junior. Uh, you know, people say that he doesn't live up to the, like his dad. You know, the he didn't live up to what his dad was. Well, obviously not. I mean, fucking nobody. Uh, guy wins seven championships. It's kind of hard to uh, follow in his footsteps. But. Anyway, um, what else? It's been going on with six minutes already, but uh, my health-wise, I got a, a uh, I was diagnosed with a new illness called POTS. It has to do with my heart. Um, if you don't know what that is uh, and want to know what it is, Google it. Um, it's called POTS. But uh, my illness has decided to start attacking different organs and stuff and uh it's possible um in august that i'll have to have a uh, valve replaced in my heart so um not something that i wanted to hear but you know it is what it is nothing i can do about it um and it seems like every time i think things can't get worse they do and uh I just keep trying to remain positive and I actually picked up a uh, project car that I'm working on right now. It's, you know, normally years ago I was into the muscle cars and things like that. Well, I just want a, a daily driver, you know, that is reliable. And I picked one up for 600 bucks. It's a 2000 Golf. And the guy got rid of it because it needed a lot of shit for inspection. And I could do the shit myself. So I picked it up for 600 bucks. The car's in good shape. It just needs a few things. I... And I did that. Everything's done. And I just want to get uh, two fenders for it. Since it has a little, tiny bit of rust down at the bottom of the fenders. And I'm just anal with that stuff. So I could just let it go. But I'm not going to. Um, I like my cars to at least look half decent. So uh, I've been kind of, re I guess, restoring it a little bit. Um, it's nice to have a daily driver again, and I, you know, if I got got to go somewhere, I can uh, don't have to rely on Heather's car. So um, it's been a lot of fun, though. It's got my mind off of shit, and I put some money into it, you know. Uh, but at the same time, it's also stressful on your body. You know, my body can only take so much when you're uh you go through these this illness so um my heart rate at times will jump up to over 200 beats a minute so that will drain your body really quickly and uh, they're trying to figure that out um that's why they think it's it's the valves in my heart one of my the valves in my heart so yeah that that won't be fun you know i don't want to get chopped open and my chest cracked but you know it's just, uh, it is what it is, man. Um, so not to sound all depressing, don't feel bad for me. Because uh, I'm happy. You know, as hard as it is some days, I'm happy. But I uh, hope you all out there are doing well. If you see this video, if you watched it, comment down below if you got this far. Uh, let me know if I should shave the beard off or just let it grow, man. Let it keep growing. I think I'm just going to let it keep growing anyway, but... Uh, um yeah man i think this is the longest i've ever had it this is uh really fucking long like it does no justice man for real like this video does no justice but uh yeah that's that 
Shout out to uh, Denny, Den1013. Um, uh, shout out to, fuck it, everybody. Anybody that watches this video. So uh, just uh, watch Dave Archer's video. Uh, that was 30 minutes long. Yes, I watched it all. Because that's how I am these days. Uh, there's not too many videos being posted. So when they do post them, I, I fucking watch them. So, so I got everybody. Love you all. And uh, comment down below. If you watched this entire video. Even if you didn't, comment anyway. Deuces.